can't just do it for one hour once a week, it has to be regular, it has to be all the time. When the InHarmony team aren't in, music is still happening, it's become part of what the school does. We use some of the um, tricks of the trade, I suppose, from the music lessons in our ordinary lessons. Everybody stand up, is sung. The children are seeing music as something that is part of their lives. Copy me, copy me, you can do it too. We start in the nursery with their children who are three and then they move up to the reception class. We focus on rhythm and rhyme, they stamp in time to the music. All those preliminary skills to actually picking up an instrument happen here. It's, it's fundamental in their belief that they can play. So, can you see they look the same? Basically, the children learn to internalise the music that they have to play. They'll have sung the music, they'll have clapped the rhythm, they'll have explored how it's written down. Year two, they start learning violins and cellos. We got into like doing his instrument and got a bit hard because like I was only little. I started in harmony in year one, which was six years ago. And what have you learned? Never quit. Never quit. Even though it's not the best of times, but we'll just get through it and then at the end of the day, it will all pay off. The children are always revising and going over what they've done and then adding a little bit more and a little bit more and a little bit more. They get that moment of going, I can do this, I'm secure with this. As the children become more proficient, they play as part of an orchestra. Working through ensembles means we're not just focusing on those children who are good at their instruments and pushing them, although we do do that, we're also able to focus on those children who can't play their instruments very well, those children who have mobility problems, those children who have poor motor skills. Those children are still able to participate. D, sh, 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 A, sh, 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 G, sh, 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 D, sh, 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 sh. OK, this time with our eyes closed. The repertoire that the children are covering in the instrumental lessons is the same as the orchestral sessions. So when they come to orchestra, everyone's playing the same pieces and it all feeds in. We also run an out-of-school nucleo orchestra. That's an optional thing. Children come along to that and they have sectionals and we have a little social time. We start at four o'clock, which is after school. The age range is about nine to 17. It does require them to commit to it, as we, we, we say. So if, especially, they've gone through to secondary school, they then still continue to come. They come back and they conduct and they write pieces. That's really quite exciting to see. More and more of our children are now getting involved in the intermediate orchestra, which happens on a Saturday, uh, which is part of the Nottingham Music Hub. Prior to being involved in In Harmony, none of our children were involved in that. <laughs> The children are so open to the music that we're doing with them that it doesn't matter whether it's classical music or rock music arrangements or pop. What they want is to be able to create really good music that they enjoy playing. The orchestra is a vehicle for the children to learn music. There's a definite progression level now. Not only are the children able to perform in front of their teachers and their peers here, but to be able to perform in a proper place, the festival hall, like they're a proper orchestra with a proper audience. I really like doing concerts and performances because it's just a way to show off how, how much I got better since the last time. When they perform, they get that feedback from an audience. They feel incredibly proud. It gives them a real confidence to keep going. They see someone that they love who comes in to watch them do their performance. It's moments like that that make our job and make In Harmony totally and utterly worthwhile.